If I sound strange, it's because I literally just woke up. Clearly, I have nothing better to do with my life than to record from breakfast till dawn. No. Uh, but I am going to go to, uh, Multi Multi Mountains. So it looks like we've got some sort of freeze flame esque thing going on. What is this remix? It's the same as that underground level, but it's weirdly done. Strange. And what is spitting? Oh? Okay, now that is cool. And that touch nothing damages you. So I'm assuming touching any of those lava rocks will damage. And since fire does half your health, uh, something tells me I'm gonna die a lot. And awkward cutting. And we're back. I don't know why the music is, uh, sounds distorted, but, uh, <clears throat> apparently there are silver stars. Can't say how I feel about that. Uh-huh, so that, okay, doesn't seem too bad. I'll leave that for later, though. Instead, uh, instead a lot of things, uh, but, uh, more precisely, uh, turkey. No, I, I have no idea. Looks like we need to go to the icy section. Oh? Okay, let's leave those coins for later. In case I really need them. The freezing is kind of cool, but it does seem kind of overpowered. Because you could easily get comboed. Like that. Oh, and I have no idea how one could dodge this, so, uh, yeah, um, Ice Flower, uh, I knew it was in this game, and I suppose this is a fitting place for it, uh, and this is actually a cannon. I can't say I was expecting a cannon. Am I supposed to blast up here? Dunno, I'm just gonna shoot over here and, uh, Apparently I can fire through the cannon. Let's find ourselves an enemy to figure out how this works. Okay then. I should've made a clause like, but if you have an ice flower, you're fine. I'm glad that totally worked. This level isn't too bad so far. <laughs> I'm glad there was a visual difference. Like I said, I hate how everything does two damage. Because there literally was no visual difference. So, uh, let, let's try this again. Like, I thought the only, the, uh, blue stuff was the, uh, dry ice, but apparently it was the, uh, snow also. That seems kind of stupid if you ask me. Also, here's more of the, uh, lava area that I missed. Also, it's really stupid how the lava does half your damage. Lava and fire. Something tells me I'm going to die a lot in this course. A lot. And that, that was a good jump. Yeah, um, I hate this level. Like, it's a cool level, and I do like the architecture of it. 
I just don't like how uh, lava does half your health. Meaning, if you get comboed, you're dead. Pretty much one hit. If you, have, if you thought eight health was too much, then make it seven. Seven would have been a nice round number. But six is just one too low. What was that hitbox? That was a terrible hitbox. And apparently there are coins over the lava itself. So, shell? And what do you know? History repeated itself. And teleport pet. Yeah, okay, that is a teleport actually. For a second, I thought that might be uh, one of the. Uh... I don't know. So I need fire flower, obviously. I'm assuming fire flower is in this part. I do like the two variants of the music, though. It, this definitely reminds me of Freeze Flint Galaxy. Or Sugar Burn, or whatever else you want to call it. I'm here in Star, uh... I'm gonna leave these Goombas for later. Okay, can we actually get up into this volcano? I'm not quite sure this is a wise idea, but let's do it nonetheless. And there's one up, and lots of death. Uh, well, since I'm feeling risky, let's go for it. Hey, we lived. I'm actually really surprised. And we got out. I'm also surprised. So, seeing as how I have no idea how to get those eight coins floating in the lava, and I'm not, I'm not prepared to. Uh, on a suicide jump. I'm just gonna grab these goons and then head to the icy section. Where presumably I'll find considerably more coins. And then there's a fire nap in that. Okay then. I'm assuming there's just a silver star back there, but uh, Curiosity killed the cat, and Curiosity's gonna kill me. No, it's a it's blarg. Blarg, Nepenem, whatever. It's still interesting how we program that. I definitely approve. It's pretty cool. And turns out it was all for nothing. Better not have been. Uh, I don't think it was, though. Here's a platform that wasn't really overly accessible. Yeah, I'm going in circles. Good. And I'm getting burned alive because the, that fire has a terrible hitbox. Let's uh, let's get out of here immediately. At least the ice one only does two damage instead of three. Although I can't say how I feel about being ambushed literally two seconds into this place. I will say though that first impressions uh, say that uh, apparently these things are freezing me. Good. Just give me the ice flower and then make it completely irrelevant. to be frozen with the ice flower. I don't want to test this theory. So how did I die earlier? Frozen ice or something? Uh, huh. Well, let's just head back up here then. Yeah, apparently this, uh, 
Apparently the snow is the ice, and the ice is actually safe ground. Talk about misleading. Now, there really doesn't actually appear to be many coins. Assume, presumably, this ice is safe to stand on. And there's the teleporter. Okay, then. This level doesn't seem overly large. And I didn't see a single fire flower, so I have no idea what to do. There also seems to be a distinct lack of coins, both red and yellow. Something tells me I'm missing a large portion of this level. Uh, that's where it came from. So what's the other... <clears throat> what's this place? Apparently it's very slidey, whatever it is. Okay, there we go. That took way too long. And here's more of red coins. Is that gonna burn me? No? Okay then. Okay then, something tells me that that frozen shy guy is going to be irrelevant. I feel like I'm gonna have to melt this ice or somehow get underneath it. Because there's clearly stuff there. Hmm. Fire flower, maybe? Yeah, all the signs are pointing that there's a fire flower, but I have not seen it. And it looks like here's... No, I just ground pound. Okay, then. Uh-huh, body heat or fire... It looks like fire flower heat. So yeah, there's a fire flower in this game, and I have no idea where it is. Unless um, this is a star, I will be happy. I don't want any stars. It's a it's a nice flower, another one. Okay then, well if that's the case, let's uh, let's freeze our Goomba prey. And then yeah, that they're frozen. Uh, do I not get coins out of this? No, no I don't. Is this the long way to Fireflower? Yes, it is. I believe I saw in the uh, demo that if you freeze something and then burn it with a fire flower, strange things happen. Yeah, I get twice as many coins. That's actually pretty cool. I see the point here. I see what we're supposed to do, do you? Melt the red ones, freeze the blue ones. It's actually a pretty cool puzzle, I approve. Something tells me it's gonna lead right to a star, however, and I have 18 more coins that I want to find first. And yeah, it's open, and... Star? No, not quite. Coins? Uh... Another ice and fire flower. Coins? No. What happens if I blow up the bomb? <clears throat> Terrible idea, I realize, but... Eh, let's try it. <clears throat> On second thoughts, let's get away from here as fast as possible. I have no desire to die with this many coins. Awkward cuts again.
So I'm gonna grab the uh, fire flower and then uh, try and find that frozen red coin. That'll at least prevent me from dying for the meanwhile. There are also like five coins, I think, by the red coin star. How many red coins do I have? Four. Eight more plus those five. I'll still be short, but not by that much. Hmm. Now the question is, are we going to be instantly murdered the second we get out? No. Uh, can I melt the sides? No. Uh, oh, there's a red coin. That's good. I, li I like red coins. There's two of them, actually. Yeah, let, let's just get it. <clears throat> Starve off death a little longer. And get two coins for melting that. Okay, then. Can I, can I kill these things? I wish I could. It seems like my... F it goes right through it. Fortunate. I'd love to kill these things for a large amount of coins. So I didn't examine what was over here. A red coin. Uh, I need it for coins, so uh, let's go and hopefully di not die. Just one more missing. I have no clue where it is. I'm assuming it's still in this icy section somewhere. Although where, I have no clue. I came from there. Or did I? No, I think this is where I need to go. Yeah, and that's that thing with the thing. But then what's over here? A loading zone of some kind. With money coins. Okay, no complaints here. Uh, that means actually that, uh, the last red coin will give me all the coins I need. Yeah, this is obviously a star that I don't want to get right now. And it robbed me of my power up. Whatever. Okay, let's not get frozen. If need be, I'll just grab two coins from where the uh, star spawned. Just to get the 100 coin star and then I'll die, but at least I'll have it. I don't know where the last red coin is. And I don't like not knowing. Oh, there it is. Okay. And falling off. Uh, I really don't like that. Let's just try and backtrack as uh, carefully as possible. Fortunately, these uh, f freezy things uh, do. Uh, a lot less damage percentage-wise than the uh, lava things do, so I can take more hits, but uh, ideally I won't be taking any hits. And it doesn't look like I will. 20 minutes for the star, can't say I like that, but uh, yeah. It was a kind of complicated level. There weren't that many coins. And now let's get the red, the, uh, red coin star before I die of exposure. Uh huh, glacial red coins. Well, that's what they were, alright. Can't say I liked that. I can't say I hate this level, but I can't say I'm overly fond of it. I liked Core 7 considerably more. 
but it's not a bad level. It's just not a good level, if that makes sense. Yeah, I know it doesn't. Let's just go get the star. So red coins, the volcano, that uh, thing with the boulders, the silver stars, that race track thing, and one other. Uh, where's the volcano, actually? Okay, here it is. And be burned alive. My favorite. Presumably there's a shell, because, uh... Yeah, you can't get those coins without taking burn damage. And then chances are you're gonna need to take two burn damage. Which means you're gonna die. Yeah, there's coins to heal you, but, uh... Something tells me that... Kays wouldn't do something that stupid. At least I imagine. He has surprised me. So, really, all bets are off. And then there's these cannons. I have no idea why there are these cannons. I feel like I'm am I like supposed to blast somewhere? I really don't know. Good depth perception, 10 out of 10. Well, at least I got the one up. Hmm. Getting ambushed by something that miracul miraculously does up one damage. I must say, it's a, it's a, it's a Christmas miracle. No, it may, it may be uh, the middle of uh, October. Whatever. I don't have to make sense. It's not my job. My job is to produce videos. And if they don't make sense, well then, too bad. And yeah, I can hear the star here. You probably can too. If you can't, well then... You can. I don't know. We're expecting some witty response, because I certainly was. Okay, new idea. Let's not land on the, uh... Let's land on here. And, uh, then... Then what? No, seriously, now what? Well, at least there were coins inside the volcano. Getting burned alive. And what do you know? We somehow managed to avoid getting burned. Really? There's a silver star all the way in here? Okay, that was stupid. I couldn't get in there because the positions were platformed so stupidly. The platforms were positioned so stupidly. <clears throat> That, that's, that's definitely a design flaw. Combine that with lava does way too much damage, uh, yeah. I think that was a bad idea. Because essentially all the, all the, the fact that lava does too damage does is you can't get hit at all by lava. Because, uh, chances are that, uh, <coughs> pardon me. Wait, what? That's where it came from. Then where exactly am I supposed to go? I'm supposed to climb up the inside of this thing? Okay then. Not quite sure what the game exactly wants to do with me, wants me to do, but I have bad experiences with these uh, rotating platforms. Okay, now what game? Okay, I see. Except I don't.
I really don't see. I blame the camera, but uh, some people might say Alzheimer's. I don't know. Nice slope of the uh, of the roof, making it impossible to actually get up here. And yeah, my voice does sound terrible. That's what I get for recording uh, immediately after waking up. I see. So apparently there's just this side chamber all along. Something tells me that I could have uh, done some sort of shortcut to uh, save a lot of time. We'll do one more star. And apparently it's the slide star. Uh, so, uh, that was over here. Okay, let's not take damage. First of all, gotta check. Okay, nothing hidden in the corners. Something tells me that this is a Kaizo slide. Because th this seems pretty thin. Not very steep, but with this camera, it feels like a Kaiser slide to me. Just take it slow and steady, and I'll be fine. Eh, it wasn't that hard, actually. I approve. It was, it was a, it was actually a pretty good and simple star. And I don't like how there's no star music there. And, uh... Hmm. Uh, I'll, I'll see what the next star is. If it's silver stars, I won't do it. Yeah, uh, I'll save that for next time. So yeah, um... Actually, first, uh... Okay, no more Goombas. I did think that they were going to return eventually, but apparently not. Yeah, 